Hi guys, welcome back. So the first thing you want to do is comb through your hair. You want to detangle it to make sure it is smooth before you start making it. Next up, you want to start moisturizing your hair. I'm using this Arami oil. I'm using this to moisturize. You can use any moisturizer you like. So you want your hair to be very moisturized before you go in. Thing you want to do guys is divide your hair into two equal half this will give you more space to work with and then everything will be nice and smooth so divide into two equal halves and then secure one side before you start braiding so i'm going to start from this side so what I like to do is try to make it not too small because you know you're braiding yourself when you make it too small you're not going to get the pattern very well so I like to go with a medium size I'm going for 10 cornrows so hence why the size is like this so and you want to make sure you have a mirror in front of you So once you have that, you're going to need three fingers from each hand, your middle finger, your index finger, and your thumb. So those are the three fingers you're going to need for the entire process. So once you have that, once you hold your three, once you hold the three hairs, you want to loop them into each other. And as you do that, you're going to pick the hair from the back. So it's corn row and not braid. So you have to pick the hair from the back and attach it to the one you have in the in the front okay if you get me this video is very visual is very descriptive so trust me guys if you watch carefully you're going to understand so just watch me through i'm going to show this step in like two or three times so just watch me okay to want to take breaks in between because it gets tiring guys it's not easy to do this yourself so well, with time you'll get used to it it's been a while i braided my hair hence why i'm feeling it okay and i really think i need to go back to the gym guys because i don't know what's happening with this tiredness You can see how very clean it is so as you move on make sure you are always going back to your comb comb your hair to detangle it as you can see i have have a lot of new grown hairs hence while well, this cornrow look like this i'm not ready to retouch my hair yet i just wanted to film this video for you guys because i might cut my hair very soon So it is quite a repetitive process okay i'm still trying to you know make my path and i'm always using a mirror guys you can't do this without a mirror because you know you need a mirror to see same way use your two fingers the middle finger index finger and then your thumb okay take breaks when you're tired guys okay <laughs> yeah don't mind me so the same way Make sure you are looping those hairs together and then taking the hair from the back and adding it to the one in the front. The last one is going to be very descriptive.
I'm really not mad at my pattern though. It looks a little bit clean and I'm happy about that. You can see I'm already feeling myself. I look finer on one side already. So this is me. I've already finished one side. So I'm going to show you guys the remaining parts now. You can tell from my face that this hair is really hurting me. You can imagine I'm making my hair by, my, by myself and it's hurting me this much. It's because I have an, a lot of new growths. Okay, so you want to make sure maybe you retouch your hair if you are not carrying a natural hair. Try to retouch your hair. I'm not ready to retouch mine yet. That's why I'm not relaxing it yet. So hence why I'm just doing these cornrows. I actually want to fix a frontal wig. So that video will come up very soon that's why i'm coloring my hair okay yeah i literally almost cried that night guys look at my face i'm so tired i was absent-minded in this place i actually forgot i was creating a video <laughs> oh my god guys ignore my face okay it's really hurting me that's why so you don't have to hold it very tight i actually i wasn't holding it very tight like i said i have a lot of new growths that's why okay so yeah you can see guys just watch this video carefully and you're going to get it trust me it's very descriptive just keep looping and crossing that hair together and you will get it and don't forget to pick the hair from the back corn rowing is very easy okay very easy guys i'm very sure i didn't do a bad job i think i did a pretty good job this is decent i actually wanted to just put on a wig that's why i decided to show you guys so in case you want to lay your frontal you don't have to start looking for somebody to braid your hair for you you can just easily do this okay yeah this is a sign if you know you're carrying any braid that is very old make sure you lose it watch this video and you know make a new cornrow by yourself okay in the comfort of your home Thank you so much guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please share it with anyone who needs it. Like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.